And today we're going back to the past to go back to the future, which is really in the past, but you will be watching this in the future. So. Back to the future. I'm wondering how you go back to the future. Yeah, it's, it's definitely a play on words. What in the world? Why does he have all these clocks? He's trying to keep up with the exact time. You never know. They're all at the same time. What is he doing? <laughs> Olivian terrorist group had claimed responsibility for the alleged theft. Oh. All them toast is done. They look like your toast in the morning. <laughs> Whatever, babe. <laughs> The toast is toast, okay? Yeah, the toast is toast, for sure. Uh-oh. Dude! Oh, I know. No way. Oh, gosh. Uh, think of that. <laughs> he is not going to do that. He's going to fly. I was about to say that. I was about to say he's going to fly across the road. He in high school. When did, what did he go by there for? To, to check on him? <laughs> no way. <laughs> he hitching a ride. Comment below if Michael J. Fox was your everything growing up. <laughs> I'm afraid you're just too darn loud. Next slave. They're amazing. Are you fing serious? Sabotage. That was absolute sabotage. Okay, back her up. Someday, Jennifer. Wouldn't it be great? Take that truck up to the lake, throw a couple of sleeping bags in the back. Lie out underneath the stars? For my mother would freak out if she knew I was going up there with you when I get the standard lecture about... Foreshadowing. Save the clock tower! Save the clock... Clock motif. This is astonishing. I love this. The first, like, 20 or so minutes of any movie is, like, you're getting to know the character in their world. Like, what is their status quo? What is their business as usual? What is their, like, homeostasis? Like, where just things are as they are? This is astonishing. It's like we have so many irons in the fire in the best ways possible. That scene, the blocking choice, was so cool. They could have just said that standing on the ground, but he takes her up on the bench. It just gives them something to do, and it's interesting for the camera, and it's interesting for the frame. We haven't cut yet. They sit on the back of the bench and connect. Yeah, everything is so deliberate, and I love it. Own your car. Without telling me it had a blind spot. I could have been killed. <laughs> now, now, Biff, now, I know. Oh, that's Biff? B, roll over when that car smashed into me. Who's going to pay my cleaning bill? Ah. Uh, and uh, where's my report? Gas lighter. Uh, well, I think those reports on up tonight, and I'll... Michael J. Fox has got to be teeny. Tomorrow. He's got to be like 5'9". Nine. Nine. Shoes on tight. Oh. <laughs> Don't be so gullible, McFly. Gas lighters love to call people gullible. Have you noticed? Personal experience. Butthead. Butthead. I'm sorry. Believe me, Mom. Dad looks young. By ourselves. Your Uncle Joey didn't make parole again. <laughs> he thinks it's so funny. Any girl who calls up a boy is just asking for trouble. <laughs> Are you for real? <laughs> I never chased a boy or called a boy or sat in a parked car with a boy. <laughs> Just happened. Like the way I met your father. How did they meet? That was so stupid. Grandpa hit him with the car. <laughs> That's actually an amazing way to meet your soulmate. <laughs> Grandpa hadn't hit him, then none of you would have been born. Yeah, well. Thank God for Grandpa's driving. Was he drinking? <laughs> Meanwhile, he's just watching the TV. <laughs> At least he could laugh, you know? He appreciates jokes. <laughs> He'd be a great audience member for a comedian, right? He'd probably be dying laughing at every punchline. 
Oh shoot, did he miss? Is it what time is it? The Einstein? Hold on. This is the DeLorean? Is this happening now? Out of time? What a perfect license plate. And this is one of the most iconic cars in all of cinema history, right? Who came up with the design? Never mind that now. Never mind that now. Right now. Not now. Not now. All right, I'm ready. Good evening. Do you need a boom mic for the audio? That's it. At least he has the dog put on a seatbelt for safety. You know, safety first, everybody. Have a good trip, Einstein. Watch ahead. Wait, the dog's going on his own? I got me the car, the car. <laughs> yeah, why would you be filming him? Baby hits 88 miles per hour. You're gonna see some serious shit. <laughs> <laughs> this expression, man. Oh, shoot. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, get it to 88. This is very risky. <laughs> Good thing he was confident in that working just to stand there significant because he shouted it how did he plan it to come back he better hope that dog hasn't died but he's for sure seen some shit is it frozen the dog better not have died that's all i'm saying the dog better not have died it is frozen did he go backwards maybe to like ice age i love the dog's expressions oh thank god for that it was just a minute. He just okay. The trip was instantaneous. His watch is exactly one minute behind mine. He must have felt the big bang though, with the with the car going frozen. This readout tells you where you're going. This one tells you where you are. This one tells you where you were. Okay, so we can put choose. The destination time on this keypad. Say you want to see the sign of the Declaration of Independence. That would be so cool. My biggest wish is to be able to time travel though. November fifth, nineteen fifty-five. What's that? That was the day I invented time travel. I remember when this was all farmland as far as the eye could see. Only 30 years ago. Damn. It requires something with a little more kick. Plutonium. Mm -hmm. Uh, plutonium. Wait a minute. Plutonium, of course. From a group of Libyan nationalists. They wanted me to build them a bomb. So I took their plutonium and in turn gave them a shiny bomb casing full of used pinball and machine parts. That's smart. Now you have enemies. They're both just going on a trip now, road trip. Oh, just him. I would go to the past first. Get, or get the lottery tickets for the future. It's not what everyone would do. I think the first thing I would do is go back to the past and meet Michael Jackson. Uh oh. They found me. I don't know how, but they found me. Who? Who? Who do you think? <laughs> the Libyans! The Libyans? What is this now? Oh, yeah, it's the one he wanted to make bombs to and he fucked up. I told you! Now you got enemies. Did he really just die? We're not even half way into the movie. He's gonna go back in time and change it. He hasn't brought any lithium with him though. He's going to 1955! Those Volkswagen vans though, I love those. I really wanna, you know, live in one of those. A bas bazooka? What is it called? Is it called bazooka? I was gonna say Basinga first. They're gonna... Shit their pants when he just whoops. That was very instant. Bastards can do 90. 90? No, you're not gonna get there. Whoa, dude. Actually made to 1955? Oh my god. Is he actually in the same plot? Is he actually in the same land that parking lot or whatever that was oh my god well they're so definitely dressed as 55 people there's no airplane look aliens yep i would think so too 
Oh, he has the suit too from fucking comic. Oh my god. This looks like a spaceship to someone from 55. <laughs> Oh my god. And he's even wearing trainers, dude. This is not Whoa. gonna go well. Dude, ah. don't get out. You're gonna get your head Excuse blown me. off. Oh my god. Doc, what did you put him into? And he died, right? Sorry I about mean... your barn. Yep, you're gonna get blown. Dude, hit 88. Twin Peaks Ranch, okay, he's at the same place. Okay, fine. Alright, okay, we're fine. Get a grip on yourself. It's all a dream. Dude, hit 88. Go back. Go back to the future. Okay, now I get it. <laughs> what? Oh my god. They haven't even made. Okay. His house is still farmland. Okay. 55, 75, 80. Oh my god. Listen, you gotta help me. Oh, stop while we're <laughs> Do they recognize the plutonium suit? I mean, nuclear energy was a thing in 55, right? Perfect. Oh, did he not bring plutonium? Like the doc said, like, oh, you need more plutonium? Obviously. Does he not bring fuel? Bro. I mean, of course, he was in a very stressful situation. He was being attacked by terrorists. Listen, you gotta help me. My goodness! See, the man was cool. He stopped. He was gonna listen. But not ooh, that woman. Ooh. Well, he's walking here. Jeez. Awesome, angry lady. She's probably the worst. Did anyone ask to say you're from New York? That's why you're dressed like that. Oh, and so it's working now. Is he gonna see it be striked by lightning? Oh. Big fly. Oh, that's Biff. That's his dad. Oh, he's always been such a douche. Your ugly ass face, bitch, and your stupid red shirt. What are you, freaking red shirt from Star Trek? Get the fuck out. <laughs> Jeez. Tell him now. Dad, stand up for yourself. But then maybe, but he can't. Because if he changes anything in the past, what if he wasn't that shy little puppy that his mom liked? He can't do anything. That'd be so hard. Because I'd teach him some karate. I don't know if it'd be any good. What? Oh, he's gonna be the mayor. He's gonna be the mayor. <laughs> That's what it means. Is that where he got the idea? in a tree what is he oh my gosh terrible in the middle of the day <gasps> jumped jumped in front of his car okay sir this is is that his mom So, so, oh no, so that is what it is. His dad won't, he'll, he'll, he won't exist. Because his dad never jumped in or got hit by the car. Oh dear. Oh dear. Where's father? This is, he is, ex she is close. She is. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Comfortable. <laughs> 
big bruise you have there. <laughs> I guess you're a sailor, aren't you? That's why you wear that life preserver. <laughs> what were you doing in the middle of the street, a kid your age? Don't pay any attention to him. He's in one of his moods. So you're my Uncle Joey. <laughs> He's already kind of in jail. <laughs> Joey just loves being in his play dance. You just leave him in there all the time. <laughs> Do you have a television? We have two of them. Oh, honey, he's teasing you. Nobody has two televisions. <laughs> Why do you look so familiar to me? Do I know your mother? Mm, yes. <laughs> do you know where Riverside Drive is? It's uh, in the other end of town, a block past Maple. Maple, that's, uh, that's John F. Kennedy Drive. Who the hell is John F. Kennedy? <laughs> um, mother? I think maybe you should spend the night. I think you're our responsibility. You can sleep in my room. Oh no. <laughs> no. Uh, see y'all later. He's an idiot. <laughs> Parents are probably idiots too. <laughs> if I have a kid who acts that way, I'll disown you. <laughs> <laughs> it's gotta be a big ass mansion, right? That's pretty big. Yeah. Doc, don't say a word. Uh oh. I don't know anything about you. Listen, Doc. How's Einstein that old? I'm gonna read your thoughts. Uh, you want me to make a donation to the Coast Guard Youth Auxiliary? Coast Guard. <laughs> now, I need your help to get back to the year 1985. Do you know what this means? This damn thing doesn't work at all. <laughs> okay, all right, I'll prove it to you. Look at my driver's license. I'm telling the truth, Doc. You gotta believe me. Who's President of the United States in 1985? Ronald Reagan, the actor? <laughs> the bruise, the bruise in your head. I know how that happened. You told me the whole story. And that's when he came up with the idea for the flux capacitor. Oh, I hope it's still there. I know, right? 1985. This damn thing doesn't work at all. Dude, listen to what he's saying. Who's president of the United States? Ronald Reagan. Ronald Reagan. The actor? I, I mean, I wonder if people knew that Reagan had political aspirations. The bruise, the bruise in your head. I know how that happened. You told me the whole story. Yeah, yeah, tell him. Standing on your toilet and you were hanging a clock and you fell and you hit your head on the sink. Is that it? Did he realize he knows? Okay, okay. Oh, this is gonna blow his mind. The flux capacitor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Show it to him. It's gonna blow his mind off. Yeah. This is cool. <laughs> he only invented it because he came back from the future. That's cool. Hey, Doc, this is it. Oh, yeah, show him the video. Thank God I still got my hair. <sighs> Thank God that hair is iconic. Oh my God, this is how he invents time travel. It's from himself. 1.21 gigawatts. <laughs> I love, I love Doc. All we need is a little plutonium. I'm sure that in 1985, plutonium is available in every corner drugstore. <laughs> I to come by. I got a girl. Yeah, Look Jennifer. What you wrote here, Doc. I mean, that says it all. Help me, Doc. You're my only hope. The only power source is a bolt of lightning. Didn't they say Clock Tower was struck by lightning? Didn't, did they? Unfortunately, you never know when or where it's ever going to strike. Yeah. Both of my ideas gonna okay, strike okay. the clock tower precisely 10.04 p.m. next Saturday night. We're sending yeah. you back to the future. Did he look right in the camera? Any of you do could have serious repercussions on future events. I yeah. want him to talk to sure. some people. Okay. I might have sort of bumped into my parents. Look at your brother. Whoa. If they don't meet, they won't fall in love, they won't uh... get married, and they won't have kids. <laughs> this oh, poor guy. Do you, you want to be a slacker for the rest of your life? Oh. That's the same guy? That guy's the worst. He was exactly the same back then, too. Good. There's somebody I'd like you to meet. Okay, yeah. Yeah, bring him over to the mom. Introduce the enchantment like by the sea. Under the sea. George would fly. How's your head? Oh, his poor dad. He just got shut down pretty hard. Apparently your mother is amorously infatuated with you instead yeah, of your father. Weird. This is heavy. This is There's heavy. Why are things so heavy in the future? Is there a problem with the Earth's gravitational pull? <laughs> Chapman under the sea dance. They're supposed to yes, go in this. That's yes, where yes. they kiss. What are you writing? Science fiction stories. I never, I never let anybody so read my nervous. stories. So nervous. Have some confidence, man. 
Nobody's gonna believe in you if you don't believe in you. About Lorraine, she told me to tell you that she wants you to ask her to be a champion under the sea dance. Mm-hmm. I feel like she might say no, though, if he goes over right now. You want me to He's give it gross. to you? Shut your filthy mouth. About, uh, <laughs> visitors. Get out of town. I didn't know you did anything creative. About Lorraine. She told me to tell you that she wants you to ask her to be a champion under the sea dance. Really? Oh, yeah. I think she'd rather go with somebody else. Get your meat hooks off of me. You heard her. She said, get your meat hooks off. He realized that man's 6'6 six, six and 220. <coughs> Since you're new here, I'm gonna cut you a break. So why don't you make like a tree and get out of here? What? If he was to make like a tree, he would be rooted. But I can't go to the dance. I'll miss my favorite television program, Science Fiction Theater. Science Fiction Theater. I'm just not ready to ask Lorraine out to the dance. <gasps> Marty. Bro, what? Silence, Earthling. My name is Darth Vader. <coughs> he like, man, I've been reading too much before bed. I need your help. I have to ask Lorraine out, but I don't know how to do it. If I didn't take Lorraine out, then he'd melt my brain. I'm loving the fact that that is what motivated him. <laughs> Don't read off of it, brother. Nah. What? Oh, yes. I'm George. George McFly. I'm your density. Oh, Biff. Destiny. Destiny. <laughs> yes. So oh. I told you never to come in here. Why is he always wearing 3D glasses? You already experienced in life. Biff. What's that? <laughs> Not using his own tactics against Biff. Ay, 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 ay. These children are just so reckless. Lorraine, my density uh, has brought me to you. What? Density? What I meant to say was. Wait a minute. Don't I know you from somewhere? Yes. Uh -huh. Yes. No, why did you go inside? You. George McFly, I'm your density, your destiny. Oh my gosh. Oh, for fuck's sakes. I thought I told you never to come in here. How much money you got on you? Well, how much you want? <laughs> the fucking kid on the side? The fuck Bro, did I, I do? I would have fucked somebody up if they just pushed me for no reason. All right, punk. <laughs> now we whoa, whoa, Biff. What's that? Yeah, get him! Hey! Yeah. Go, 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 go! Oh, three for one! <laughs> <laughs> They're hauling ass out of Converse. Oh, that was cool. I had a thing under my skateboard when I was in middle school that would spark would when spark you it. it. That's pretty dope. Oh no. Hey. Nice. Was he gonna run the people over? I mean, he's on the sidewalk. Yo, he's out for blood. I'm gonna ram. What are you doing? What are you? <laughs> oh, you should have stepped on the bed. That was pretty cool. Literally. Oh, yeah, that's satisfying. <clears throat> yeah, it's so fucking gross, though. No, stop looking at him. I'm gonna get that son of a bitch. Where does he come from? Thirty years in the future. But I'm gonna find out. Dude, no. she's fucking no. Like... She's swooning over him. It's your mom. She strapped it down. Cover the time. How the fuck? Yo, she's fiending. She belongs she's... in the FBI, bro. <laughs> that tracking is insane. He took off. When <laughs> is Marty here? <laughs> Don't lie to me. <laughs> <laughs> but I was kind of Giving wondering if, before, I'm like, oh. <laughs> if you'd ask me to the enchantment under the sea dance on Saturday. Oh my gosh. You mean nobody's asked you? No. Not yet. You can ask someone to ask you to bring you? <laughs> it's kind of weird. <laughs> Sploosh. Oh.
He's going to see his own death. Well, don't tell me. No man should know too much about his own destiny. We run some industrial strength electrical cable from the top of the clock tower. Meanwhile, we've outfitted the time vehicle with this big pole and hook. We're electrifying the cable just as a connecting hook makes contact. But that's going to be like a split second. Yeah, the timing is... is uh, He's I telling him. Please mm. take whatever precautions are necessary to prevent this terrible disaster. But he's writing it. Do not oh. open until 1985. Right. That's a great idea. I'd love to park. Oh. Marty, I'm almost 18 years old. It's not like I've never parked before. What? <laughs> Marty, you seem so nervous. Is something wrong? No. It's not going to work. She's into it. <laughs> you shouldn't drink. Why not? Because you... Oh, she drinks a lot in the future. Oh, yeah. Jesus, you smoke too? Marty, you're beginning to sound just like my mother. <laughs> That's a way to make her not attracted to you, right? Just be super uptight oh, uppity about it. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, she was drinking, like, just a cup of vodka at breakfast. Mm-hmm. Ooh. Been in a situation. I'm... Marty, you seem so nervous. Is something wrong? You all right? You're right. What are you doing? You shouldn't drink. Why not? Because you... You might regret it later in life. Oh. Jesus, you smoke too? Marty, you're beginning to sound just like my mother. <laughs> this is so ironic. <laughs> Have you ever uh, been in a situation where you knew you had to act a certain way? Oh, you mean like how you're supposed to act on a first date and what I do in those situations? What? I don't worry. <laughs> Oh no, the level 10 cringe. What? What? Oh god! <laughs> the fear of God in his eyes! When I kiss you, it's like I'm kissing my brother. Oh, you. No. It makes perfect sense. Let's friend zone this and move on. Yeah, that's. Yes. Look at what we have here. Leave it alone, you bastard! That's for messing up my hair. The hell are you doing to my car? Hey, beat it, spook. This don't concern you. <laughs> Say that again. I said the keys are in here. Hey, you. Get your damn hands off. <sighs> George, help me. Please. Just turn around the fly and walk away. Oh, that's horrifying. No, Biff. You leave her alone. Oh no, he's gonna come save the day and then she's gonna fall even more in love. Yes, do it. Finally. Are you okay? She is now. Ah, oh, shit. Say that again. I said the keys are in here. This is not good. Run, George! You've got this. Kick his ass. Kick his ass. Kick his ass. Oh, Come on, George. I think you got the wrong car. Stick Black. up for the lady. And don't walk away. away. Go. Don't fucking do it. Close the door and. No. <laughs> don't. Quick, Lorraine. You're Get out of the car and run and run. Oh, George. Damn it, man, slice my hand. Who's it is? Slice his hand. Is he somehow the lead guitarist? <laughs> and then he will have to play. Kick him in the dick. Rip his pee pee off. Yes, George, feel the anger. Yes! You did it, George. Kick him a couple times just to make sure. I'm so proud of him. Are you okay? And then in a couple of years' time, you have Marty and be like, wait, this kid is exactly like the kid I tried to hit on in high school. <laughs> he hasn't got long. The dance is over. Unless uh, you know somebody else that can play the guitar. Did I or did I not call this? <laughs> My darling oh no, his sister's gone. Love. Kiss! George, aren't you going to kiss me? I, I don't know. No! <laughs> this 
Why is it so stressful? Why is, why is this film so stressful? Oh, he's losing his life. He's figuring out to play. George! Why is George such a pussy? Excuse me. Thank God. Finally, he's grown some balls. Now he's got to get back to his present time. Oh, he's going to play his song. He just jacked this song off someone. <laughs> he's going to get the credit for it. Maybe his dad in the future will have more courage now that he actually stood up to bullies. Hopefully, anyways. <laughs> They're like, what the fuck is happening? <laughs> He's gone too far now. He's gone too far. Okay, now it's time to leave, Marty. You've taken it too far. <laughs> oh no, Marty's getting weaker. Man, everyone's just taking advantage of Lorraine. Like, what the hell? Excuse me. Yeah, dude. I also love how that guy was like, forcefully dancing with Lorraine, was laughing like a cartoon villain. <laughs> <laughs> yes! <laughs> ah, he's restored completely. Yay! All the time. Ah! <laughs> oh my God. The, I love the way that whole thing is executed. It's just great. It's great. Okay, time for some rock and roll. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah! I'm so excited right now. I can't contain myself. I'm so excited. This is, uh, this is an oldie. It's not an oldie. Yay! Look at the, like the damage control he did on his image. Oh my God, he's gonna be so confident now. This is great. Maybe he'll be an author. I don't know. I know that like he goes back home and his parents are like better than they were when he left, but I don't remember like if he pursued a creative career or not. I really hope so. All right, we're taking a little too far here now. They're not ready for this, Marty. I guess you guys aren't ready for that yet, but your kids are gonna love it. Your kids are gonna love it. Ah! Oh, the letter, he found it. Uh-oh, he's upset. You find out 30 years. You need to read it, Doc. You have to read it. I refuse to accept the responsibility. In that case, I'll tell you straight out. Oh, oh no, he's gotta go fix that. Great Scott. Great Scott. You gotta fix it, man! What bad timing! Oh no. Of course a piece is gonna fall out of under from under his foot. Damn it, Doc. Why did you have to tear up that letter? I know. You only have I more know. time. You do. You change the time. Wait a minute. Yeah. I got all the time I want. I got a time machine. Yes. Ten minutes ought to do it. Yes. Good job. Engine running. All right. Uh oh. No, 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 no. At this point, we're not even gonna make it back to the future. What the heck? Oh no. Go, 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 Marty, go. You have to go. No, no, Doc. Go. Go, go, go. Come on, come on, come on, come on, Doc. Plug it in. Doc, plug it in. Oof. I don't know if you have to worry about Doc getting killed by the terrorists. Oh. <laughs> okay. All right, all right, all right. Nice. That's an awesome shot. Come on. I got a time machine. I can just go back early and warn him. Oh. Oh, he almost. Of course. No. Don't move your foot. Don't move, dude. That upper body strength, though. Nice. Okay. The timing. Okay. 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 Lift your foot. Lift your foot. Lift your foot. Oh, oh my.
fine. Yeah, we still got this problem. Okay. Oh, go. Don't even question it. Doc, you gotta get it. Gotta get out of there. <laughs> of course. Oh of course. Oh my gosh. Is he gonna have to... Come on, come on, come on. <gasps> Plug it, plug it, plug it, plug it, plug it. What, what, what are we gonna do? Okay. Oh. Go, 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 go. Go. Oh, he's gonna get some. Oh, shoot, I like to keep him. Whoa. <laughs> Dude, that's crazy. He saw it for the first time. Like, this thing worked. <laughs> that was just so cool. <laughs> he actually went into the future, bro. Yeah, there might be some uh, questions about what the heck just happened. 124. I still got time. Oh my gosh. Oh snap. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, not again. The problem is, is now that he didn't go back to his own timeline, isn't there going to be another him? Possibly. I don't know how. No. I don't know how uh, tight they are with time travel stuff. Come on, come on! He has to wait. When he's almost... No, he doesn't have to wait. He has to put it already. It's short. Oh, because oh. of the tree. See, everything goes against that. No! <laughs> oh. <laughs> no but it's not good. Oh, yeah, that's going. why the clock is not going to work. I know, because it's connected to it. Come on, 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 Well, you have no idea. <laughs> 124. I still got time. Oh my gosh. How about the other one the, of him? It's him. What? There's not of him. Because he's the one who went back in the past, man. He's still dead. Cannot make it. Oh no. Did I not tell you? Yeah. Did I not tell you that is not good? Did I not tell you? It's a loop then, and we were right. Who knows how many like him they are stuck in a loop. He's dead. You're not in the right... Uh... He's oh. alive! He has bulletproof whatever! I think he did read the letter, Bob. Aya. He came prepared, Marian. <clears throat> See? See? Man so old. Not all that talk about screwing up future events. Oh, I figured. What the hell? <laughs> Me up when you get there, all right? This will be about 47. Ah, oh, so he's going in the future. Yeah, he is going. That's what he wanted in the first place, remember? And his parents is different than he what he remembers, Bob. <clears throat> For sure. Maybe they always been like that. Mm -mm. Let's see, let's Remember see. Remember he said like his father stood up beef and he never did that. Oh, their house looks different. Which one was it, Craig or Craig? I don't no, know. I can't keep up with it. different. It's different. What? Because his father stood up beef, but that changed the future. Oh. Good morning. Oh. <laughs> I couldn't laugh. You guys are great. Mom, you, you look so thin. Oh, thank you, Marty. George. Yeah. <laughs> Well, Mom, we talked about this, but how can I go to the lake? Car's wrecked. Wrecked? Sure, the car's fine. Why am I always the last one to know about these things? See, there's Biff out there waxing right now. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, Mr. McFly. I, I meant I was just starting on the second go. See, he changed the future, Bob. He made himself again? Okay, I'm a little confused now. That's great. That gotta be nutty. Seeing whatever you just did. Yeah, that good.
look like he got a bulletproof vest on. Yeah, yeah. The no, he put it back together. I figured. What the hell? <laughs> oh, and watch that re-entry. It's a little bumpy. He said, watch that re-entry. It's a little bumpy. <laughs> He got up to 80 miles an hour in the residential area. <laughs> Damn. 88 at that. Hey. I don't know. I can't keep okay. up. <laughs> he looking like everything hey. around this thing different. What the hell is this? Yeah, what they is They smarter. What you Everybody's more intelligent. Marty. Were yeah. you cheating? <laughs> no. Hello. Good morning. Look at him. <laughs> <laughs> Aren't you going up to the lake tonight? You've been planning it for two weeks. Mom, we talked about this, but how can I go to the lake? Cars yeah. right. See, there's Biff out there waxing right now. Uh, now, Biff, oh. I want to make sure that we get two coats of wax this time. That, I'm, I'm sorry, Mr. McFly. I, I meant I was just starting on the second coat. Hey, he got Biff working for him now. Biff ever since he yeah, you done changed. The, 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 that was some good changing you did, Marty. Coached your son, coached your own dad into a better life. He got that truck. Marty, you're acting like you haven't seen me in a week. Right. I haven't. <laughs> yeah, Marty, he's been through a, uh, he's been through time. Oh, yeah. Oh, here he goes. He done pulled back up. You've got to come back with me. Back to the future. This concerns her, too. Wait a minute, Doc. Well, what are you talking about? What you happens to us in the future? It's your kids, Marty. Something has got to be done about your kids. <laughs> He done turned that thing into a flying. He done put the sauce on that bomb. He done put the jammy Jew on there. He went to the future 30 years and figured some stuff out. Came back in 10 minutes. Now the car fly. This is going to be possible one day, y'all. I, I wish I was here to see it. I hope I am here to see it. I, they probably already got one. This movie old. And that car looked like it, you know, it could be a real time machine. Let me go travel through. I want to see some, you know, I want to go back and see Dinosaur. You're better off without having to worry about all the aggravation. That's a lot. Yeah. <laughs> That's a lot. Like, man. what? Yo. Man, finish the whole box. Like, what? <laughs> yeah, and then in the morning, you're going to be hungry. And you ain't got none. Reminiscing like, man, I probably shouldn't have ate that much last night. Oh, man. I don't think it's cereal. It's like peanut brittle. Oh. But it, that's, it's sugar and, and peanut. But, like, that's a lot. Like, <laughs> right. Like, oh, the way I okay. met your father. Yeah. That was so stupid. Kinda, Grandpa like, hit him with the car. It was meant to be. <laughs> anyway, hey, you, uh, for y'all that don't know, Ashley the actually rest of my wife that, was like she's borderline genius. I shouldn't have. I shouldn't have exposed that. I shouldn't have exposed that. Him laughing. Yeah. Yeah. It's one of those ones where his laugh is what. Sorry, I shouldn't say him. borderline. She is a genius. <laughs> This baby hits 88 miles per hour. Yo! You're gonna see some serious shit. Did I expect cussing? <laughs>